Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be teaching y'all how to use World Edit using a wooden axe in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. So this is kind of what it looks like. You can just kind of draw lines. You can make it so it's like pasting whatever you want. This can be TNT. This can be diamond blocks. This can be literally anything and it can be any kind of shape. So this is kind of for mountains and weird lines and stuff. So like if I just fill it in, I can terraform like a big mountain. Uh, yeah. So it's only when I'm holding the wooden axe just gotta get that through and now this is actually uh all fairly simple but let me get you through and teach you guys how to do it so you're gonna need a command block which to do that you're just gonna do slash give at s command underscore block if i could spell block and then boom that'll give you one i already had one and then uh in that command block you're just wanna gonna do um it's going to want to be repeat and always active, but I'll go into that in a second. So the first thing you want to do, well actually there's a few th early things before we get to the command block. So you first want to do slash game rule, command block, output, this is all one word, false. Because this basically will not make it so it doesn't spam your chat when you're using this. And then this is the start of all the commands. So we're just going to do slash, uh, tag at s add world edit so i already have it but and then you're just going to send that message through so i don't need to because i already have it and then uh we're just gonna we basically need to build something like this so you're gonna make like a five 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 well uh seven by seven like border and inside this border you're going to want to make whatever you want to copy over and over. So if you see, it's kind of copying this thing over and over and over. So you can make anything. This can be a mountain of TNT. You can make this even bigger if you want. This is just the dimensions you went by. And then once you're done doing that, uh, if you don't have any spaces on the bottom, you're just going to place this right there. And then you're going to go on the side and you're going to go up until you get to the top. It doesn't need to be one above. It needs to be lined up with the top. And now... Uh, let me just show y'all one thing that y'all can do real quick, which will make this part easier. If you go to your settings, and then you go to creator, and then you can turn on the copy coordinates UI, which that is this thing up here. So all you got to do is you got to look at the block. You want to switch this to block position. It should be on my position. Switch to block position. Click right here to copy. Paste it into the chat. Go over to here. Go to the chat, copy, paste, boom, it's in the chat. And so obviously you guys are going to probably want to pause because there's a lot of complicated stuff. And then after you're done, you need to break these blocks or it will copy these blocks everywhere too. So then, time to get to the command block. The very hard, well I mean it's easy as long as you copy it. And I believe I'm going to be putting the command in the description or comments. I just need to remember. So that should make it easier. You can just copy and paste it right in. So, as I said earlier, it's repeat, always active, nothing special down there. And then we're going to do slash execute as at e tag equals world edit has item equals item equals wooden axe location equals slot weapon main hand at 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 s positioned bunch three up arrows 10 run slash cologne and then these first three coordinates are going to be uh the court like the first set of coordinates you copied and then these next three are going to be the next set of coordinates you copied so you don't want to just use my coordinates you want to use your own coordinates remember that and then you're gonna do tilde negative three tilde negative two tilde negative three masked masked and normal and then after you do that if you get a wooden axe whoops you should be able to start building things and it's actually really cool like we just made this weird looking circle thing which obviously isn't a perfect circle but yeah it's really helpful for terraforming and mass like projects and stuff so um uh i think that is gonna be it thank you guys so much for watching if you guys have any questions go to the comments put them there or my about chat uh page you can go to my discord server and ask in the tutorial questions thing i'll probably be more likely to respond faster and with more detail if you do it in the discord server but uh yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see y'all in the next one 
Hi guys, uh, I'm back. I just wanted to make a quick announcement. So basically, I have just hit 3,000 watch hours, which means I've unlocked super thanks and like super chats or whatever, and memberships. So if you guys would like to support my channel, you can go purchase a membership. That will give you benefits and stuff, and it'll be monthly. Cheapest one is 99 cents a month. Most expensive, well, I guess there is one that's $99, but that's just a joke. Most expensive normal one is uh, $5. Um... And then, if you want to show support, uh, because one of my videos helped you out a lot, or you just feel like helping someone out, go into the comments, and you can do a super thanks. Thank you guys so much for listening. See y'all in the next one.